Hi right, guys, today uh, Oren and I are just going to go through some more grip breaks. Um, today it's going to be the double sleeve grip and double lapel. So sometimes the opponent is going to fight you double double sleeve grip, and it it's, can be if your opponent is strong and dominating you, it's pretty hard to break. Okay, um, because what's going to happen most of the time your opponent with double sleeve will push your arm down, and what I want to do is I try and as I try and lift, he does a soda, and I'm gone. Okay, so we don't want that. Okay? Sometimes you can't help it because when he pushes down sharply, you lift. You just do it because that's judo. You react to everything he does. We don't want that. So what I want to do is keep my good posture. Okay? I don't want to start bending over. With one hand, I cross my arms and put one of his arms on top of his other. And now I've stopped his own arm there. And I've broken his grip. And I can strip and start again. Okay, so again, he's got, we're fighting, he has double lapel. A double sleeve, sorry. We're in good position, okay? I don't want to be lifting up, trying to get top grips, because he's going to so day me. I don't want to be staying down low, because he'll probably just transfer to a top grip, and now I'm in some trouble. Okay, so straight away, we're keeping good posture. Cross his arms. Break, break, start again. Really, really basic, but really, really effective when someone's double, double sleeving you. The next one's double lapel. Very, very hard to break. Double lapel is really, really good if you're stronger than your opponent, if you've got longer arms than your opponent, and you're like a sort of guy, you've got long legs, okay? Double lapel, very hard to break. The reason it's hard to break is because I'm trying to pull this down, but this guy's not moving because he's got such good control of the lapels, okay? So it is very good. So what the first thing I want to do, stay tight on one arm, on the wrist. With the other arm, I want to come inside. See that? Can just move there? I'm going inside this here. That's just going to break his arms a little bit. Okay, and he'll have this other lapel. Now from there, I go back to the start now. Because I've taken his arm out, this helps. And now, and start again. Okay? He's it. Got a good, strong grip. It's hard. He's also he's doing all sorts of stuff. Okay? But what I want to do is go up. Not too high, obviously. But, for exaggeration, but up. And inside of my elbow is inside there. Don't worry about gripping here, because this hand goes on here. Now from here I've got two options. One, I can, I can probably throw from here, but he's strong, I'd rather just start all over again. Okay, here, there, break. Exact same as normal lapel grip. He's still got this one. Okay, so what I want to do is quickly transfer, and there we go. You're going to break his grip. So there's two more um, grips, a double sleeve and a double lapel. Two really strong um, positions if you know how to use them. Uh, thanks heaps for watching.